Welcome to another edition of Vita Blaze. My name is Today Samson. Today we'll look at 11 reasons you should stop watching pornography. 11 reasons you should stop watching pornography. Pornography is any material, printed or visual, containing explicit description of sexual activities with the intention of inappropriately stimulating sexual excitement. Sadly, with the internet and mobile phones, pornographic materials and videos are now easily accessible and has become one of the fastest form of destructive addiction with the terrible consequences that have trapped countless number of youth and teens. Indulging in pornography is due to uncontrolled lustful passion and desire. As Christians, no form of impurity and sexual immorality should be found amidst us if we truly claim to know God. 1. It is addictive and destructive. Pornography pulls a person more and more into sexual addictions and ungodly desires. It will destroy your destiny. Proverbs 6 verse 25 to 28 says, Do not desire her beauty in your heart, and do not let her capture you with her eyelashes. For the price of a prostitute is only a loaf of bread, but a married woman hunts down a precious life. Can a man carry fire next to his chest, and his clothes not be burned? Or can one walk on hot coals and his feet not be scorched? 2. You will be committing adultery. Matthew 5.28 says, But I say to you that whoever looks at a woman to lust for her has already committed adultery with her in his heart. Because there is no way you will indulge in pornography without foiling lust in your heart. 3. It affects your relationship with God. Pornography addiction will pollute your mind, your thoughts, and disconnect you from God. 4. Pornography addiction will invite unclean spirits into your life, exposing you to demonic sexual oppressions. This spirit can stagnate your life. 5. It can lead to other destructive behaviors such as rape, homosexuality, sexual assault, and violence. 6. It increases marital problems. It diminishes trust and intimacy between couples. 7. It leads to a greater risk of sex outside marriage for the married ones. It is one of the main reasons for separation and divorce. 8. It leads you into all other forms of sexual sins, masturbation, fornication, prostitution, polygamy, and so on. 9. Pornography ruins how you think about sex. Indulging in pornography corrupt and pervert sex. It harms you physically and psychologically. 10. Indulging in pornography ruins how you think about women. It affects your normal relationship with people. You begin to see women as sex objects to satisfy your sinful, lustful desire. 11. It will send you to hell. Pornography addiction, if not dealt with, will attract the wrath of God and send you to hell. In Ephesians 5.5, 5, it says, For you may be sure of this, that everyone who is sexually immoral or impure, or who is covetous, that is, an idolater, has no inheritance in the kingdom of Christ and God. 6. Let no one deceive you with empty words. For because of these things, the wrath of God comes upon the sons of disobedience. Have you been indulging in pornography as a person? And are you already becoming addicted to it? Or is your relationship and marriage at the verge of collapsing due to porn and sexual immoralities? Why don't you surrender everything to God today? allowing him to restore you and help you deal with your addiction. Don't postpone your salvation. If you are ready to give your life to Jesus, please place your right hand on your chest and say these prayers after me. Dear Jesus, I know you died for me. I forsake all my old ways today. Forgive me of all my sins. Accept me as your son and daughter. As from now henceforth, make me your own. Write my name in the book of life. Help me to grow and develop in you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I pray for you today. The Lord will uphold you. I curse any form of addiction in your life. Receive your deliverance in Jesus' name. Everywhere you need healing, I pray that the Lord will heal you in Jesus' name. For in Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed. Amen. 
if you have any questions or comments please put them down in the comment section below thank you and god bless